And Rocco, never the way you script it when a starter has to leave a game early, but the way you guys came in and patched this thing together, that's about as good as it gets in terms of a, a whole team win, I would imagine. Yeah, it's a, a sunny afternoon for the for the bullpen uh, coming in and getting the job done like that. It's just, you know, you, when you get in those situations, it becomes like a, I don't know, summer caravan type of situation. It's just one after the other. You bring them in, you drop them off and let them go and, and pitch. Um, I mean, you could go right down the list of guys, uh, you know, going out there and and uh, and pitching good, throwing in some spots where they're going out there for multiple innings. Um, but we needed every one of those guys. We, it's not like we had, uh, uh, you know, ways to go out there and and help a guy or, or start bringing other guys in to, uh, you know, really match up and things like. We just had to hand them the ball and allow them to go out there and do their jobs. Um, and they, they, they did, and they did it thoroughly, and they did it till the very end. Wait and see on Mally, or is there any clarity now? Uh, he's going to get an MRI. Um, there was nothing uh, acute that was bothering him. Um, he had some general, um, I think, soreness, uh, but he, he didn't mention anything that was painful. Um, you know, he said the ball wasn't coming out, obviously, the way that he wanted, um, but he was still able to pitch. Uh, that being said, um, you know, there were there were moments um, and discussions that were had uh, in the first inning or two because we knew the ball wasn't coming out the way that it normally would. Um, uh, you know, sometimes it's, you know, you don't let it get past a pitch or two. Um, he didn't look like he was in any sort of distress. The, you know, the velos were just down. Um, and I would say, you know, once we get to that point in the game, um, we did see the, uh, the velo actually tick up at the end of the second inning to 90 and 92, which give you, gives you kind of a glimmer of, uh, you know, or of a thought that he's going to end up, you know, okay and pitch through this. And then he ends up, you know, in the third and fourth inning, exactly, you know, closer to where he wants to be. Um, and it's just a day where... Truthfully, the ball's not coming out great, but I didn't have that feeling as we started, you know, getting into the third inning and watching him continue to pitch. Obviously, missed a lot of July with the right shoulder. Is there any concern that lingers right now? Um, well, there's always concern. I mean, we we had to go out there and, uh, you know, he exited the game. So there, there's obviously, um, you know, some attention that's going to be placed on this. Uh, we're going to learn more, though. Um, I think he checked out relatively okay after coming out of the game um, with one of our doctors. Uh, but that being said, we're going to learn more uh, today we're, and probably in the next couple of days. We're not making any sort of roster move. It's not. This isn't the sort of thing where we're going to immediately um, do that. We're going to spend some time and, uh, you know, again, getting more information I think will be key. What can I ask you, you know, they showed you on the in the dugout and you obviously were concerned, and then all of a sudden, you know, okay, I'm going out there. What was it specifically? Was it just the velo and stuff? I mean, it was two different things. I mean, the velo was obviously a question from the beginning of the outing. And, um, again, it, it did tick up to somewhere closer to a, a normal fastball for him. Um, but, you know, you saw him have a couple of movements where he was, you know, stretching something in, in you know, his upper half and, you know, putting his arms up in the air and moving a little bit. And, you um, that was it. I mean, it, it was probably on the on, on the border of he was probably on the border of coming out of the game sooner than that. Um, we didn't leave him in the game because of this, but truthfully, it would have been a very challenging game for us to finish uh, if he had to come out, say, in the first inning, and we grabbed him and we we pulled him out of the game. Um, it, we would have been it would have been by a hair that we would have been able to finish. You know, nine innings. Forget about if we played. Uh, extra innings, or if we had to, you know, you know, if one of our pitchers wasn't efficient enough, and we had to go get them uh, because of of that. Um, luckily, none of that happened, and I actually, luckily, uh, Tyler was able to go out there and and you know give us what he did. Is this